and artifacts of Mars. And by now, most of you know that one of the most evil uh, slime balls on the face of the planet has been killed. He uh, blew himself up along with three of his own children when uh, forces were closing in on him. El Baghdadi, uh, according to Washington Post, was an austere scholar. And Mr. Newt Gingrich had some words to say about that, as did a whole bunch of people online. They actually had to change that headline because uh, people were furious, as well as they should be. But since this is obviously, you can tell from the Washington Post article that this individual was a friend of the American left and one of your heroes, so, uh, I extend, I as Artifacts of Mars, hereby extend my sincere condolences to these individuals on the left, the people in the media who are attacking President Trump and elevating Baghdadi to essentially martyr status, which is what he want, wanted. He died as a martyr. Baghdadi was one of the world's most wanted terrorists for several years, having helmed ISIS as it rapidly expanded across Syria and Iraq, carving out a so-called cal caliphate that was some 34,000 square miles at its largest extent. The group also secured the allegiance of numerous other militant groups worldwide. No, they didn't say terrorists. The Post published an ob obituary of Baghdadi, but quickly amended the headline three times. First vision de version described Baghdadi as an Islamic State's terrorist in chief. Well, then this was changed to austere re religious scholar. Austere religious scholar is what these uh, people actually think of them. It was not clear why this change was made, but second version of the headline prompted such outrage that it was changed once again to read Abu Bakar al Baghdadi. Extremist leader of Islamic State dies at 48. But the austere religious scholar description drew outrage on social media, especially among prominent conservatives who cited the headline as evidence of post political bias. Boy, is that an understatement! <sighs> Well, there you have it, folks. The left is mourning one of their own. This guy was obviously uh, very important to them. And that wicked Donald Trump, sitting there in the White House, Situation Room, watched as he was taken out by U.S. Special Forces. Left is a morning, so, you know, take it a little easy on them for a while. Uh, there's always a morning pe uh, period when one of your heroes dies, and to listen to the Washington Post, at least, this guy was like family to these uh, people. That's about it for today. Just uh, wanted to condole. Uh, offer my condolences to the American left on the loss of their uh, friend, Al Baghdadi. And can we get serious for a minute? This was one of the most evil monsters on the face of the planet. Uh, regardless of what the left thinks of him, I'm glad that he's gone. Thank you, President Trump. Well done. I'm Artifacts of Mars.